and everybody is set for this matchup between the Philadelphia Eagles and the Carolina Panthers here at Bank of America. Bank of America Stadium about to play host for this exciting matchup between the Philadelphia Eagles and the Carolina Panthers. You know, all week long, people have been talking about this matchup, but not about the ground attacks on either side. And we noticed while meeting with the teams this week in our production meetings that both coaches have a lot of confidence in their running backs here today. Yeah, even though they don't have the star, the marquee running back, I think they're, uh, both teams are hoping to catch the other team by surprise, thinking it's going to be all about the pass. And uh, they, they got a pretty uh, complicated running game coming against us, so we'll see which team reacts the best. First down here. Play action fake and dropping back the throw. Makes the reception. Count it. Touchdown. Well, you work all week long in practice. You get a script. You come out here to start the game, and it works perfectly. And you take the opening drive down the field, and you score. The Panthers for the extra point. point the kick is good and after that extra point the Panthers are leading by seven the Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff
will start his return. And he's able to get out to the 34-yard line. to the line and it's first down. <laughs> Keekley who makes the tackle. <laughs> they bring in an extra defensive back. And it's the base 24. Right Second down and 11. Looks to his left. The pass fails to find the mark. You got to be smart on the defensive side now here, third and long. Be a little careful. Maybe give up a short pass or a short run. And if they throw it short, make sure you come up and make the tackle. Hey, let's go. Split backfield here. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. He's such a smart linebacker. That's one of the reasons why he was able to knock that pass down that time. He diagnosed the play. He saw what it was going to be, got himself in position, and he made it happen. about this they're trying to pick up the first down on fourth down forgetting the punt drop back shotgun formation trying to work that left side fights off the hit they're across midfield with that play always hard to pick up that first first down good job by the offensive coordinator designing some plays keeping the defense off balance to get his team in rhythm Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. That's a gain of six. Well, this early in the game, to watch the opposing nine, offense nine, nine. march down the field and get inside the 20. This keeps the defense, uh, they might be shaking a little, but if they stop them here till field goal try or work, the big skins on the ground. One thing coaches hate when their offense is on the field is fumbling the football. Because a lot of times, it's just bad fundamentals. But they're lucky this time, they had the fumble, they're able to get on top of it. Third down and seven. They'll run with it again. The tackle is made, short of the first, and that'll bring up fourth down. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. The interception. They've got him down there. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. First down here. Play fake here. Trying to work the middle of the field. Makes the catch deep down the middle of the field. When you can throw the football that high, that accurate, and man, it is beautiful. Right on the target. Nice catch. What a play. Come on now. This play set up by the long gainer, D'Angelo Williams. It's a touchdown. There is nothing like a long touchdown run. It takes so many elements to make it happen. Good blocking up front. A broken tackle by the running back. Blocking down the field by the receivers. They had it all. What a touchdown run. Panthers ready to get the pigskin in the air. start his return. Fakes him out. 
and he's tackled at the 32-yard line. What a job by the kickoff team. The hustle, everybody's sprinting down the field, and they get rewarded. They give great field position to their defense. The defense comes out in the nickel. From the gun, eyeing that left side. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. You know, when that football was coming towards him in the air, he knew if he caught it, he was going to take a big hit. Well, you know what? Good thing he caught it, because if he'd have dropped it, he still was going to take a big hit. Nice catch by the receiver. The give. They knocked him down behind the line of scrimmage. Nickel formation for the defense here. The formation here, shotgun. Looking across the middle, two defenders there defended incomplete. Well, you want to put all the pressure on the quarterback to make really good throws down the field, play tight man-to-man -man coverage. It takes perfect throws to get completions. Not there that time. On the way, third down. Out of the gun. Looking to scramble the throw to the left. Just couldn't get his feet down on that catch. We see it so often nowadays. All the quarterbacks moving around the pocket. That time he gets outside the pocket. But as he looks down the field, nowhere to throw it. Nobody open. Just another incomplete pass. Not sure why they're going to go for it at this point, but they are. They're not going to punt. These defensive backs are ready for a battle. Throwing now to his left. Panthers turned the ball over on down. That was a terrible job that time by the offense. The head coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Uh, the play is there. The players just did a terrible job of executing. The defense comes out of the nickel. First and ten. D'Angelo Williams. Gains maybe five. The off-tackle run is just what it says it is. You're going to read the tackle's block and decide whether you're going to go inside or outside. Usually, this is the first running play every team puts in their offense when they go to training camp. Offense lines up here. Second down and five. Play action fake. Looking to throw. Secures it with two hands. Touchdown. Well, you got a lead to drive down the field to score a touchdown. Now we're going to find out if the other team can stay patient or will they panic. The AT coming up. Extra point is good. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. setting up the return. Breaks the tackle. <laughs> Offense going to stop the game here with a timeout. The Eagles getting set now for their next series. First down, offense readying for the snap. Wait 20. Wait 20. Snap back to the quarterback. A takeaway. He's got a little bit of daylight here. Touchdown. They're just running it up. Well, the quarterback was under pressure. He could not see the defender. The defender in the right spot makes the catch and takes it back for a touchdown. The Panthers for the extra point. He made it. Panthers ready to get the big skin in the air. He's a dangerous returner and held a chance to show you right here. Well, there's nothing that time the kick returner could do. Terrible blocking up front. Nobody gets their job done. 
And that's why they have bad field position. First down on the way. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Airtight coverage, incomplete. And what you do in man-to-man -man defense sometimes, get up there and disrupt the wide receiver. Disrupt his rhythm, disrupt the timing, and what do you get? 